up, nerds? Uh, check it out. We're here at GameStop in Henrietta. I thought they just abandoned Henrietta, but I, I guess they moved to this new location. Let's go. Oh, they got Cody Rhodes in the window. I really like Cody. I'm stuffed at this. Hey, that. Look at all that prime. Look at all those forever chemicals just ready to give you cancer. Anyways. Let's go. Aw, oh, man. Look at this. They got PlayStation 5 side. Look at this. I can't believe this, man. I wanted to go in there and see some nerdy stuff. But I guess... I have to wait. Oh, they're closed due to, like... What? What oh, the hell? What? It's you! RK Chaos? What the hell are you doing here? Ah, that Luigi! <laughs> what? Skinny Mario! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I got some video games I was gonna oh get. Oh my god, of, it's funny. I was, gonna, I was gonna trade them in, but even if you want them, I mean. Hell yeah, I want them, yeah, son. Thanks. Right, well, Check this out. Alright, well. Look at this. A controller. I need one, and they're closed. You totally need a controller. Because I suck. Next time. There's always next time. Look at who's here. Feral. <laughs> The Mighty Inferno. Right. Well, enjoy the games. Stay tuned for the unboxing. And we'll see you in the next one. And the next one. Later, dude. Listen to this. One multiplied by one is two. Weird. Sup, nerds? All right, man. You've seen the beginning. You know what happened. Now the key is going to be to seeing what he sent me. And here it is for nerds' eyes only. This box looks familiar. It's top secret goonie shit. Nerds' eyes only. My cat is going crazy. It's a perfect time. So now check this out. Let's make it a little brighter. And now we open it. Are you ready for the madness? Miss Kitty, get! Just knocked all my stuff over running through the house so, as soon as I click on the camera. Not before, not a second before, as soon as I clicked on the camera. And I'm getting texts. And. Nothing stops me. Not even crazy ass bitches like Miss Kitty. I said it. All right, man. Let's see what let's see what's in here. Let's open this box up. You know what I'm saying? So, like, I I don't. Let's open up this box, shall we? With my lucky number this year. Twenty-two-year-old Ninja Turtle sword, all up in your throat. Ready? Join me, shall you? Oh, day! You heard me. I said it. Suit on this damn thing. Look, I tried to do it. I tried to do it justice, but cat's hanging outside with some oh, mind void cat. Freak of nature. Oh, check this out. A card right on the top. Oh, what's it say? Christmas greetings from the Griswold family. Wow. That's unique. That's right there on the top. Well, what's behind? What's underneath it? Oh, okay. All right. Rope. Nice. Some strong rope, too. 
Well, all right. Cool. What's next? Okay. Okay, a little, a little weird, but... All right, let's make some perfume or something for it. Put it in there, I guess. All right, what's this? What is this? Oh, I think this is... I've seen this girl around before. What's her name? I mean, you can't... There's no clo oh, she's got clothes on, actually. She's got clothes on. She's got wraps. This is Cleo, the mummy chick. She's got clothes on. Look at that. Thanks, Pharaoh. My daughter will love it. Weird box so far. I, I don't know what else is in there. What's this? Solomon Seal Sav. What? What? Oh, I've always wanted a canteen. Oh, dude. Wow. And it's... 20 years old, 25 years old, 2004, 2000, what year does that say, 2004, 20 year old canteen, check that shit out, buddy, man, Pharaoh, you knew exactly what I wanted, you love it, man, that's cool, the rope is a little weird, and a canteen, a doll, I'm digging it. Here we go. Arcade Chaos. That's your boys, Tooley. That's me. The king of... Oh, my God. This... I already know what this is, and I don't even got to pull it out. That's the Monopoly, man, because I'm so fucking rich. I fucking knew it. That's badass. Look at that. Oh, she, man. Look at that. You see, oh, she, oh, fool? That's cool. Oh, what the fuck? Yes. I need to get out of jail free card because God knows this is going to be the summer of fun. Wow. That's cool. All right, here we go. Just in, it's all chromey. Just in case your birthday celebration gets out of control. Hey, thanks for all that support and friendship over the years. Enjoy the box of goodies. Feral and fear no. For, for real in the inferno. Man, I still laugh when <laughs> the first time I heard <clears throat> Retro Arcade Music Man say his name in a live stream, I still laugh. I can't, I wish it, I wish it somebody had it. He's like, oh, hey, and welcome, Pharaoh. <laughs> it was funny. I was, I'm just being stupid. That's badass. I love it. It's going to go up on my, it's going to go in my Monopoly. Uh, my Monopoly montage. Speaking of that, I got a lot of stuff coming up with uh, showing you some different things I picked up. Um, and then I'm going to have you guys actually vote on... I only have one, two, three, four, five. I have a certain amount of shelves and stuff, and, I'm gonna, and, I, and I have a certain amount of things I collect. Right, Snoopy's already getting a shelf. He-Man's getting a shelf. Star Wars is getting a shelf. So it's going to be who else gets the shelves. You know what I mean? Because uh, like it's it's gonna be based on my collections. I'm go it, it's just we're just starting, and then eventually I'm gonna have bigger shelves with bigger and more toys. So I'm saying. All right, enough with the tape. Enough with. What the fuck is this? Are you fucking kidding me? Holy fucking shit! I can't fucking believe it. You motherfuckers, the beginning of this, I cannot believe this just fucking happened. I shouldn't have probably pulled it out, but he seen it, and I was like, wow. Holy shit. Well, I'll show you that. Damn, I can't wait, because I just seen this for the first time in the window earlier when I was minding my own business, and he showed up with this box. This is crazy. Because you're going to say to yourself, and if you, when you see the beginning of this video, you're going to say, oh, he knew it. I I swear on anything you want me to swear on, my entire family gets everything. I had no effing idea. But this is the first time I've seen it today, and I own it. That's what you talk about when you say, that's why. Oops, I almost squeezed the box. That's what I'm talking about. Well, I'm going to leave that sealed. <laughs> Oh, dude, games are in trouble now. So I'm about to, I got the big, got the big hands back. 
I think I just blew my load right that way, right off of the muscle. I think the whole video is over. All right, good night, guys. Go order some SpongeBob pizza tonight. I kiss the ones you love. Let's get this. Let's do it, man. Because we just can't make another trip. Because I was thinking about sending 80s packets with this box, but I don't think, I don't think they're fitting. Anyways. Oh. They got me. Roger Rabbit shot me right in my butt. Alright, enough stuff. I wanted to get him in the video somewhere. Because I was like, you want to see something, boy? I'm the king of claw. Ow. Mm. I'm not fucking kidding. If I say it again, this is... You can stop it, pause it, fast forward it, rewind it. This is the fucking fifth time that I... <clears throat> here, go, here it goes. I smashed my elbow on a fucking rack that you don't have no room getting through this aisle in the store down the street. It fucking hurts. And I'm not playing. I wasn't playing. It's on. Shit, the dude already owes me. I don't even want to get into... What is going on here? Oh, hell yeah. Honestly, it's my favorite version of them. I mean, everybody has their own favorite version. This is badass. I love it. Ooh, and it's got the thing in there, which I ain't popping out. I'm leaving that. I don't know what... Let me guys know in the comments. If you get your... um. If the tab holes are in, do you leave them in or out? I always left them in if they were in because it was rare for me to not pull them off the shelf. I'm with it, you know what I mean? So, I love it. This is badass. It's my favorite version of Iron Man. And I never showed you the Iron Man comics I do got, but I had tons of them. But like I said, I only was able to save a few. And they're all in cardboard and plastic, my Iron Mans. I wish I had my, my other ones on... Uh, in case you guys don't know who Iron Man is, check this shit out. You know who Iron Man is? He's a genius mind and suit of armor. A genius, never mind, it says Iron Man. A genius mind and suit of armor make Tony Stark a real charmer. Stopping villains where they land as an invincible Iron Man. To all the women. That's awesome. Now you know what I, this... I just realized something. I, I was thinking, like, where's my black Spider-Man? Because I don't have none, nothing else. So it's the size he, they made that Spider-Man I have from the movie. The black Spider-Man from, um, I forgot the Tobey Maguire one. I still have Now, he fell off the card. The card I put away somewhere. And it just came off the card. Because it, it came with the damn DVD, right? So, it was like... I guess I'm getting sidetracked about the Spider-Man. But this is... He can play with him now because they're the same size. Dude, I love it. I mean, the rope, though. That's going to come in handy. Oh, dude, yes. Yes. Oh, man, look at this fucking card, dude. Captain Shy Guy. Yes. I, he knows I'm a fucking huge fucking Captain America fan. This is badass. I love it. Look at that. God bless America, the land that I love. Stand beside her and guide her. Come here, Miss Kitty. She's just, you know. I don't, anybody else have a pet that when you try filming, loses their damn mind? That's Miss Kitty. I love this. Yes. He said, you might love it. You might not. I love it. Ooh, dude. I think I got this comic right here. I do have it. I had this comic. I have it somewhere. Yeah. Pretty sure I still got this one. That's awesome. I love it. X-Force is badass. I can't remember all their names, but this chick, uh, what the hell's her name? They're badass. Oh, shit. Mixed blessings. What is this issue? Uh, let me show them. I don't know why I'm not. Did I show you that one? Only if I even show. I, I'm talking about comics. I didn't even see comics. Yet. Oh, my God. My brain. He's like locked. He, I think he's got a brain implant in me. Um, 
So I have some X Men ones still. Uh. God, it's going to be so good. Oh, man. Hmm. That's an interesting looking issue that I don't I have really honestly a clue what's, what's going Anything goes on. I can't wait to read it. Oh, there's more. Oh, fuck all that. Let's just do it. What the fuck? What? Dude. X-Men. Okay, I'm going to show them to you, and then... Oh, okay. Featuring the Pulse Ponder premiere of the brand new Marvel Superstar. Dude, this is a thick one. Annual, part 264 pages. Thick. You know, and I've had... The only comics I got are the comics I've had for years. I've read a million times. So there's no zest into it. Really, reading them a million and one times. Even though I do got some good ones that are really re-readable. And it's been a long time. But these are going to be great, because I, I can't... I don't have no clue what these... Ooh. And these are like 64 pagers, which are great because then you don't got to worry about doing anything else about reading like one a, a night. Fucking A. Oh, dude, that's a, like, hold on. Damn. The New Mutants. I got a lot of these, but I, I honestly don't know if I got this one. What issue is this? Oh, this is into the 50s? Hmm. I don't know. I got a big run of these, but I don't know which one it is. This, I, and I've always looked at the covers, so this cover don't ring a bell, so I'm glad that I got that. That's badass. Oh, Gamby. Oh, dude, what's that? Look at that Gambit. Nice. I love Gambit. The world's greatest comics. De December number four. I had never seen. I had never. I've my buddy collected the Gambit comics. My buddy Jason, because he was his favorite X Men. Um, so I know I haven't read that. And then I could just tell by the covers that I, if I read, oh yeah, Colossus. I love fucking Colossus. One of my favorites. He's in that one. That's gonna be good. Colossus, I know, one of my favorites. And then we got Phalanx Covenant. Man, I can't see. Everything's blurry, and my glasses are freaking dirty. They're cool. X Factor 106. Hmm. Interesting. They're nice and thick. And they're all in mint shape. That's freaking awesome. Part 1. Ooh. Who's he fighting? He's fucking him up. Oh, is that all the comics? Damn, dude. That's badass. Alright, let's just get through it because we just gotta get through it. We gotta do it. Or if we don't do it at all. Where's my Monopoly card? I gotta put that in there. Let's just stay shiny. Ooh, what? Dude. Bowser. And I've been wanting to get these, the monster trucks. Because, like, I was just talking to Pixel Chick today earlier. She just donated a bunch of her. I don't know all of them, but she donated a ton of them to the uh, food cover, which I did the other day. I did. I took a five pack. I took. Remote control Thanos helicopter, some Xbox, sealed Xbox games, and I left them in there, you know, and stuff. And, you know, not to be a dick or sound uh, like, a, you know, anything. It's in a place that needs it. How about that? It needs stuff like that. Beside the food, and then we, you know, I brought some food and different things. Check this out, though. Look at Bowser's stats, dude. His name is Bowser. He's just, he's... It's a character truck. He's a, his strength is monstrous, and he his crash attack fire breath. That's cool. Oh, that's badass. Fix like that. I have Taz. It's in mint shape. I don't got many, but I do love the monster trucks. Obviously, I love them. It's the one thing I used to do with my dad. My real dad. <laughs> I please. He wishes. What's this? Brick and delivery. Oh, cool. It's a fire car. Because he's a fire guy. I have something bricking. I don't think it's brick and delivery. Yo, is it that the... Is this a rare or something, buddy? Special feature. That's cool. I love it. I love Hot Wheels. 
I was just telling, I was talking to her about our Hot Wheel journey in life. How, yeah, I'm, I'm done collecting, you know, comments and stuff. I just got my daughter, to, my, um, a new Batman. Um, so, she's got, um, there was a gold one or whatever. This, what is this? And I was just holding and, and dusting him earlier because he looks like he's falling off my Darth Vader um, boxed figure over there. Uh, my Mario. Ah, uh, dude, can you see him? My, my eyesight's going. I pushed it all night. It says, spin out Luigi. Ooh. Spin out Luigi? Look at his face. That's a badass detail on his face. Come on, man. Look at that. I like that. Uh, that's well done. The green. And, yeah. I was just thinking about all my Mario little figurines. Because I seen two through the window earlier that I don't have. And, it's, of course, they're in a four-pack with two I already have. That's cool. What do you do? Oh, he's got triggers. What does he do? Oh, he does it on himself. So he spins in 360. Yeah, because cause he's faster than Mario. People don't know that. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. I love it. Mm, he's going to make me. Or I'm going to want me to do. the hell is this heavy old thing? Oh, I know what this is. This is the coffee mug. I won for being awesome. I love the red handle on it. That's my favorite part. And then the red you can see on the top. That's cool. So you win this for being awesome, guys, on his channel. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I love it. I'll use it tomorrow. Okay, what's it saying about him? Orca. Orca coatings. And it's straight China. So top of the line. We're going to, we're going to, um, and then there's a, oh, there's a thing on, what? Oh, it's called the Contrast Coffee Mug. Okay. That's the name of it if you want that one because there's a different color one, I think. All right. We're going to get down to the... Oh, shit. We just got to do it. Dude, Cyclops. You already... No, you didn't give me this card. I so say you gave me the Cyclops, but it's not this one. Awesome. And these cards are freaking great quality to overpower cards. I love... Cyclops has always been my favorite. Don't get me wrong. I love other X-Men, but... I mean, we all know. We all know. You can love who you want. You know, you can love your gambits and your wolverines. I mean, with the exception of maybe Jean Grey. Ain't nobody killing him but himself. You know what I'm saying? And everything and everyone. We already know that. <laughs> oh, no. I've just, I, I've always loved Cyclops. I can't help it. Now, this is a great game. I love this game. I don't think it gets a lot of credit because of the big sprites. You know what I'm saying? And uh, and a lot of times, like I said, I've said it before. I, I've, a lot of times I haven't been a fan of big sprites. When, well, when big sprites first started coming out in like consoles, I, I wasn't a big, huge fan of it, right? If anything was bigger than the Mario that I, I got beamed into my brain, I was like, eh. Great game, and I appreciate it. Now I got two of them. So how many of you nerds got two Black Wrath Manas? Hey, eh? and think so? You probably only got one. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Wrath of Black Mana. Now I got two. Thanks, Pharaoh. This is the one. Dude. I'm so fucking happy. I'm so fucking happy, dude. Damn, who? Dude, I gotta give this game back to some guy in Boulder, Colorado. No way, bro. It's mine now. I love it. This fucking game's awesome, bro. I I got so much fun out of this game when I was a kid. And um, I played it on an emulator I have somewhere around here, or it was on the um multi disc uh cart that Keith gave me. But this had a lot of memory. I never got rid of this one. I always loved it. It's still challenging. I'm sure some of you guys are like, oh, I know that whole game, and it passes so, like, easily now. Well, that's good for you. Go play some caveman games and bash your old brain in. No, let me stop. Dude, I love it. <laughs> Look at it, you guys. Should I? No. 
Eh, why not? <laughs> They're probably dead. I'm sorry. That was fucking horrible of me. Davida. Davida Bloom. You're awesome because you love this game. And you put your fucking name on it. Unless that's something else, I don't know. But it looks like a name tag. It's like, bitch. TNC Surf Design Fools. Now this one, I would like to complete. You know what I mean? Because here we're, we're going to get into the whole NES Shabanga Langa very soon. Dude, I love the whole box. Now we got this thing in here too. Ooh. And he knows he's being funny because of my memory, but this stuff actually works. Check this out. It's a magnet. For your own fernal magnet. Whenever you need to start a fire, it's made out of reactive metal. You just take it and then you go outside. All you do is Get the sun to shine on this part, the shiny part, and you hold your finger on the magnet. And then as that happens, you can go like this. And then a fire comes right out the end of it, right out of this part. But you got to make sure it just works just right. So if you order these magnets, you got to hold it like this. First, like this, so that it charges. And then you go like this, make sure the sun still hits it. And then you turn it, and that's when you set the world on fire like Megadeth. Check this out. Super Mario match. This is heavy. This is made out of straight fucking titanium steel. Can you match five in a row? Match five of your favorite characters when Fantastic for Memory develop all in one character. Oh, this, you know what? This is serious, though. I'm not even trying to be funny. This is going to be, this would be fun for me to play because of a simple fact. Remember in Mario 3? Well, it's Mario 3, right? Or no? What is it? It's the Wii Mario. Well, we got to climb... And then hit the memory things. You know that. what It's Wii Mario, right? I'm pretty sure it's Wii Mario. The new Mario Brothers on Wii. Which is one of my favorite fucking Mario games, by the way. Has this part. Dude, I love it. Thank you. And all bullshit aside, thank you for lunch earlier. I love that place. Place was kicking. Yeah, he's, he's been bugging me. So, you know this pl that place he's been talking about Mission Barbecue for... Ever, it's well worth it, dude. I don't know where to begin, do honestly. Like, so now I'm gonna do it. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try to edit it up, make it nice and good. And I appreciate you guys coming by watching it. I'm gonna stop wasting your time. I'm gonna pick my top three, just like he said he did, right? So we got it all here. Well, obviously, number one. <laughs> um. This is difficult. Because believe it or not, when I first looked at it, I didn't realize exactly what that was. I thought that was some, like, something I wouldn't play. But that, that Mario game is pretty badass. So, we we definitely, we're going to have to go with the the new controller. Holy schmackaroli. I love it. Oh, my God. Games, I'm back. I got, because this is the size I need. And it's over. My fingers are going to readjust, and I can remember, because now, let me show you something. See how this is? And the, uh, where's the other controller? It's right here. There's a big difference. And now you're going to see me destroy games. I'm about, I got like, I got over 500 on the Switch, so it's they're getting destroyed, finally. And I love it. And, I, and to be honest, you got to say what you want. I, he, he asked me, but I, I prefer the... The uh, corded ones, but just for the simple fact that <laughs> it's I can't play my game that I want to play because you can say, "Oh, well, you're you're just dumb." Well, then I guess I'm dumb. But I I can't play a comfortable game with a wireless one because I always feel untethered and unconnected, and like something's lagging or that. It might start dying, die in the middle of a game or something. So I've always thought that. And then, of course, people are like, oh, well, you get warnings and all that. Whatever. That's my point. I, I, I like the wired ones. Because they're, they're better quality, in my opinion. You know what I'm saying? What what happens when all of a sudden you can't charge that one anymore? Is there something special you can do to them? Like unplug them? Oh, they got the, it's got the thing in it, too. So where you can plug the headphones in and all that. Um, did I pick a number? Well, the comics are pretty badass, and I love the Luigi. 
But I have to pick a top three. And if I'm picking a top three, honestly. And I've been wanting. I apologize. I gotta pick. Alright. I gotta pick my top three. And that'd be, if I'm being honest, my favorite. One, two, three. It's gotta be. I don't know. It's hard. It's hard for a two and a three, but I'm going to put the comics at three, even though they're probably, a, in the end, going to probably be my favorite shit. Comics will be number three. And coming in at a close number two is definitely this. Captain America. Cause I, I just fucking love Captain America. And number one has got to be this because of the nostalgia. And I love it. It's still, to me, fun. And I've been wanting it. And I was going to pick it up the other day. But the one I seen, it, was, it wasn't it was that great. For, and for the price, this has got a great label. Look at that. Look at it. And what I mean by the other one is, it was clearly the other one had all wear here. And was faded and stuff. And I, so I could see it that way. That's all I could see it was that. Who knows how well that was, but I could already tell it was better because there was none of that. Look at that. That's beautiful. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> I want to play this now. I want to stream it again. Because I played it randomly one night, but I definitely... Let me know in the comments if you guys want to see me play this. Rat the Black Man is great, too. It's a fun game. I played it many times. And I, I no, I have not, don't beat it. But I think if there's a game I could beat, I think you could beat that one. This one would be good to beat too. Still, this was one off the list right here because there's not many that are on my NES list that I can rattle off the top of my head. And this is one of them. And out of nostalgia, owning them, playing them, enjoying them. And the other, there's two that I mentioned constantly: Karnov and Karate Kid. And I'm sure there's others, Kung Fu Masters and. You know, a bunch of other ones, but, like, those are the, like, more oddball ones. So, thanks for the Griswold family vacation card. I'm glad you're back on vacation. Thanks for the rope. There's been this rattling in my trunk that just won't stop. Her name is Kim Mathers. All right, so, that's it, man. Thank you, dude. And with that being said, ladies and gentlemen... Will you enjoy the ending insanity? <laughs>